All right, we're getting ready to try out this uh, Easy Vape Pro, which we just got. This is for uh, doing a oxalic acid vapor treatment on some of my beehives back here. Um, this is uh, made by a gentleman, John Oliver, and who we purchased it directly from. He makes these units. It comes with the unit you see here. These little inserts, which are silicone. Uh, I got four of these. This is where you put your oxalic acid crystals in. And that's the inside. And uh, has a little temperature controller and timer up here. And uh, the once it vaporizes, the oxalic acid comes out the tube here, which you insert into the uh, a quarter inch hole in the back of the hive. So we're going to give this a try. We wanted to show you a little bit more on this uh, Easy Vape Pro. Uh, this runs off of 110 current and uh, we have a good extension cord that runs out to our apiary but uh, you could get a inverter a 110 volt inverter to run off of a battery or car battery whatever you have but this is how this is where it gets its uh, uh, power from is this uh, 110 volt uh, plug. Okay, so with this Easy Vape Pro, we got four of the silicone uh, inserts which go on to the unit itself. These hold your oxalic acid crystals, which I've got here 99.6% uh, pure oxalic acid crystals. And um, we're going to put a half a teaspoon in each one of these and put them on the hives, get them ready to start uh, the vaporization process. Okay, during the treatment, um, we're going to be wearing these nitrile gloves that you see here. And also um, a respirator. This is certainly something you need to have. This is a 3M respirator. It's a biological respirator as well as chemical. It's approved for doing something like this oxalic acid vapor treatment. So we will be wearing this. We will be wearing some uh, goggles also. And we're also going to be very careful not to uh, try to breathe or be in the direct line of the actual vapor. But uh, when you're doing this oxalic acid treatment, you definitely want to go on the side of caution and follow all the cautionary guidelines. Okay, so again, we're going to use this 99.6% ox oxalic acid crystals. And we're going to be putting a half a teaspoon in each one of these. And that just about fills it up, a half a teaspoon, which is the recommended dosage for a standard hive. So when they give you four of these, um, you can get them all prepared like I'm doing here. Set them up on the top of your hives and be ready to... Uh, Go from one hive to the next. I'm just going to brush off some of this extra here and we'll go and place these next to each hive so it'll be easy to put them on. All right we're going to plug our unit in here to the 110. You may not be able to see this here but uh, at the top here in the red it shows the temperature it's heating up very quickly and the set temperature 
for operating. Again, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this, but right here it is 440. And this makes a little uh, noise when it's ready to go. It's up to 130, 140. It's heating up very quickly. All right, so we're going to do our last hive here. So we've got our little silicone cup here filled with the oxalic acid crystals. And we've reached the uh, temperature here. So we're going to turn this unit over to put it on. Now you don't want to take your thing, your silicone cup, tip it over and put it on there. Because as soon as the crystals hit this heating pot here, they're going to start vaporizing. So you don't want to do that. Again, you want to take your unit, place it over your silicone cup, press down kind of firmly, and you could actually, uh, we're going to take our plug out here, you could actually almost insert this in the hive, but we're going to do this. There, it's vaporizing. Okay, prior to our treatment, we did uh, stuff some, uh, these are just some shop towels that we put in all the entrances of the hives to seal them up, keep the bees inside. And again, uh, the temperature is probably around uh, 43, 44 degrees outside. So the bees are not flying anyway, but uh, this way all the bees that are in the hive are in there. They'll all, they'll all get the treatment. You don't want to do this out when you have your forager bees, field bees, out flying around. Uh, the most effective treatment is to have all the bees in the hive. And just before we started our treatment again, we sealed up the entrances at the front of the hive. And if you have an upper entrance, you need to seal those off too. You might even be able to use a piece of duct tape to seal off any other entrances. Uh, because we're just kind of barely into spring right now, the bees have pretty much propolized and sealed up pretty much the rest of the hive. Okay, so now we're going to get over. We've moved our stuff over here. We'll get ready to treat these two hives. Again, we already have these little cups pre-filled with the oxalic acid. So let's get to the treatment of the next two hives. Okay, so that concludes our second treatment in week number two with our Easy Vape Pro oxalic acid vaporization using this uh, almost 100% pure oxalic acid crystals. Our Easy Vape Pro, which we purchased from John Oliver. And our respirator and the measuring spoons again we used a half a teaspoon into each one of these silicone cups which you get from john oliver so we're getting ready now we're going to go out and pull out the towels from the entrance of the hive so the bees can come and go and well okay we tried uh this easy vape pro and uh we've used it about uh two different times a total of, uh, well, three treatments each time to cover the uh, once a week, 21-day uh, period for giving the oxalic acid vapor treatment. And uh, I have to say this uh, Easy Vape Pro has worked great and uh, it seems to do the job. Uh, it does kind of look like it's homemade, but the main thing is, is it works and I think it'll hold up just fine. And uh, considering the price of another type, the Pro Vape 110, um, that's around roughly $550. And um, uh, this Easy Vape Pro here that I got from John Oliver, uh, with shipping, it was around $120. So there's obviously a, quite a price difference. And um, I think this thing works great, and uh, uh, I think it'll work just as good as the more expensive model. 
I highly recommend using this if you want to do oxalic acid vapor treatment. Uh, you can save a fair amount of money uh, by getting this Easy Vape Pro from John Oliver. And I'm going to put his uh, business card up here so you can write to him uh, directly. So thanks for watching and um, got to get those varroa mites under control.